Aliyah Sadiq is working on her latest commission. I actually just got into spray paint um, in the last year. I'm still really new to it. I'm still playing around with it. But this is far from what you would call her normal canvas. But I love spray paint. It's really fun uh, and it's kind of messy, so I like that. Her normal medium of oil paint won't work. Her canvas spans several buildings. Aaliyah is painting in an area near 16th and P, a redeveloped part of Midtown with a Starbucks, local businesses, all restored or rebuilt. But walk a little further down 16th Street, you'll find Opera Alley. And thanks to the Capital Area Development Authority, it's turning into more than a thoroughfare. It's turning into a work of art. It was like a blank ca canvas. Lasagna Glenn is a resident service representative for CADA. She saw adding some color to Opera Alley as a way to help take care of her tenants who live in an area facing the alleyway. I just thought that a mural would be a good way to represent Kata in this alley, and I thought it would be something very nice for all of our tenants as well as the neighborhood community to see. She mentioned, you know, we could really use a pop in this alley. Karen Ulip is with Kata. And while the Development Authority has been responsible for a lot of new places to live and businesses in Midtown, they see redevelopment as more than just new buildings. They gave me the theme. Um, since this is Opera Alley, they wanted an opera scene. Um, but they basically just let me kind of run with whatever I like. So um, that's definitely a rare experience when they actually give you that full reign. So I definitely took advantage of that. And this is just the first panel. By the time Aaliyah is finished, there will be three full buildings covered with paint, all part of a plan that sees redevelopment as much an artistic endeavor as an economic one. In Sacramento, Dave Manocherry, KCRA 3 News.